Introducing ExamDocs, the cloud-based examination paper authoring tool. The preparation, approval and production of high-stakes examination papers is a daunting process. Collaborative drafting and approvals, document version control and approvals and printing deadlines all to be conducted within a secure and confidential environment. Take this example. Here's Sharon. She's head of department and responsible for preparing and producing a final year examination paper. She has exactly one month to write, approve and print the exam paper. Sharon calls a meeting with Seamus and John. They discuss the forthcoming examination and agree it should contain two questions. Sharon asks Seamus to write question A and John to write question B. After the meeting, Sharon emails a template of the exam paper to both Seamus and John. The following day, John writes both questions A and B and emails a password protected version of the Word document to Sharon. But Seamus has forgotten about the exam paper and a week passes before he submits question B using a USB thumb drive. Now Sharon needs to merge the contributions from John and Seamus and to decide whether she should adopt the question B submitted by Seamus or erroneously submitted by John. A few days later, she has prepared a, a draft of the paper containing both questions A and B. She emails this to Seamus and John. Next, she emails a copy to Janet, an external subject specialist. But Janet doesn't have Microsoft Office on her computer, so she converts it into a simplified text format for reviewing and editing. Meanwhile, Seamus has spotted an error and spends an hour drafting a revision and justifying his objections. What he doesn't realise is that John has spotted exactly the same mistake. Unbeknown to each other, they are simultaneously reviewing the same error. Because her text editor doesn't have the correct fonts, the version uploaded by Janet contains formatting and pagination errors. So Sharon now has three versions of the same document to review and condense into a single file. One week later, she emails an updated version to her team for final review. Just a few days before the submission deadline, Sharon remembers that the paper must be authorised by Frank, Head of Quality Assurance. Frank hastily reviews the document and requests that the order of questions A and B is reversed. With the printing deadline now looming, Sharon quickly edits the Word document, hoping that none of the graphics or tables it contains are lost or reformatted in the process. At the last minute, she emails a PDF version to Chris in the printing room. The task is completed, but not without wasted time and stress. And although everyone adhered to college regulations governing the transmission of confidential documents via password-protected email and USB thumb drives, over a dozen different versions of the electronic document now exist on different computers and storage devices scattered around the department. Any one of these could be targeted by unscrupulous students. Let's look at that scenario again, this time using exam docs. The first thing Sharon will do is to define her team and the function of each member. Some will be able to make changes to the document, whilst others will be limited to viewing mode only. Next, she can split the document into sections, giving each person individual access to sections, chapters or pages. Finally, she can define a process flow, with each step having its own objectives and deadline. Now, Sharon doesn't need to do this with every exam paper she writes. Instead, she can apply process templates created by exam docs or reuse previous versions. Sharon uploads a copy of her Word template to the secure exam doc server. This is automatically converted into HTML for viewing and editing via a standard internet browser. Next, using the exam docs user interface, she invites Seamus and John to write question A and B, respectively. Seamus receives the invite and accesses the exam doc server via his web browser to insert text and graphics into the document. Settings created by Sharon prevent him from interfering with the document layout or format, however. This time, John has forgotten about the deadline, so exam docs automatically emails him a reminder. He dutifully contributes his question to the online document created and stored securely by the exam docs platform. 
It's worth stressing that both John and Seamus have contributed to the same document via a standard internet browser, even though their access is limited to a single question. Furthermore, every change they have made has been archived for audit control purposes. Having reviewed the online document, Shar now proceeds to the approvals phase. Both Janet and Frank automatically are sent invitations to review the exam paper rendered by the exam docs platform. The fact Janet doesn't have Word on her computer doesn't stop her from reviewing and commenting on the document, whilst Frank is authorised to reorder the questions himself. With over a week left before the publishing deadline, the examination paper is now ready for submission to Chris. Job done. Let's review the features of exam docs. There is only ever one document, so version control is significantly simplified. Every change to a remark made about the document is stored for future review and audit control. And because each contributor can see what other contributors are doing and saying in real time, there's little scope for confusion or ambiguity. The ability to give each contributor and reviewer customised privileges affords the document owner substantial control over who has access to the document either in part or whole. And the fact the entire authoring process can be orchestrated into serial or parallel steps means crucial reviewing and approval steps are not overlooked. Finally, the use of automated reminders means no one can fall asleep on the job. Draft documents are stored remotely on the secure exam doc server, and because the documents reside solely on the exam server and is never distributed to team members, the security risk is significantly reduced. Whilst features such as automatic timeouts mean it's virtually impossible for collaborators to accidentally leave online drafts vulnerable to opportunistic inspection. Exam docs. Better exams mean better grades. For more information, please go to the ExamDocs website at examdocs.com.